Matt Cutts has been warning us for a very long time, don't buy links. Buying links is outside of our guidelines. In fact, he started in about 2005 on his blog, and this was post Search King in 2003. So he's been telling people for a long time, don't buy links, don't participate in link schemes, and certainly don't try to do this for, for legitimate businesses because you'll wreck your website. And he's been giving these warnings for a long time. And with Penguin, he was able to implement some of these things. People had talked about bad link neighborhoods for a long time, and it forced us to really define this and say what a bad link neighborhood was. Some ideas of bad link neighborhoods and places that you shouldn't get links from people that are just emailing you and begging for links. We call these link beggars. Any link schemes that you get emails for just out of the blue, unsolicited emails. Any place there's pills, porn, and casino links. If you're a local plumber, you probably don't want to be getting links from there or places that there's payday loan links. These are what we'd call a bad neighborhood or what Google calls a link scheme. Any link intended to manipulate page rank or a site in Google's rankings may be considered part of a link scheme. Now this is very broad and vague and from 2004, 2005 as Matt Cutts was fighting this paid link battle um, he was telling people over and over don't participate in link schemes, don't buy links, don't buy links. And while that was happening he was building the Penguin algorithm and and the ability to fight this spam with algorithmic means and algorithmic filters. 